This one is a winner's bracket match, while Truman and Constable are in the sub-bracket. Indeed. Um, so yeah, Truman uh, was pretty close against Dumar. Um, it was 2-1 as well, as to be expected. You know, a lot of these races are going to be very close. But Cosmic has been putting in a lot of time, so I'm thinking he might be quite competitive. Um, yeah, this Mughal arm is back. Sorry about that. No uh, challenges from anyone. Between Silverstar and Moomini, it's very, very hard to say. Um, probably very close to 50-50. Silverstar, probably, uh, with a slight edge. But, um, very hard to call. And can be rather unpredictable, as we saw earlier. If you saw the match between Seathorn and Volpe, anything can happen. Yeah, that match was it was incredible. Um, I just caught that match. Oh uh, wow! Really, it was tied at the third third and final match. And at this sort of level between these two. Pretty much expected to come down to that. Even losing a couple of seconds could be uh, game over. But who knows? We might see some big opportunities for either of them. It it has happened. Everyone had clean eighty kills. Looked like Cosmic had to bop him one more time. Is Moo Mooney accurate? No matter how many times I pause and unpause, his timer is way behind the rest. Yeah, I'm just trying to get them sorted as well. It's always going to be difficult with four streams. Um, it can be a bit like kind of spin plate, a bit impossible. Okay, so looks like everyone's moving on now to um, Donut Secret. And it looked like a couple of 361s at the bottom, 362 for Silver Star in that last level. Cosmic having a little trouble getting the shell. Moo Moon is showing off the color glitch there with the pipe. Not bad, everyone is still real close here. Yeah, I was gonna say earlier that the four of these, um, like the four of these races could be all very, very close. Um, I reckon It'll be very close to play far between all of them. I wouldn't be a lot surprised if we were within like 15, 20 seconds of each other. By the end. But the have all been looking pretty good so far. Where we could see some separation 
for the first time is most likely yeah. going to be in Star World 1. I don't want to curse. So I don't want to say that they're going to nail it because I'll probably curse it. Wow, this sink and just how close all of these guys are is just incredible. I'm not even really a lot surprised though. But I must say, for you know, being mainly a Super Mario Brothers player, keeping up with someone like Truman is pretty strong. Looks like Silver had to go down slow way on the first go. So it looks like now we've got some separation. Yeah, Cosmic. Um, oh wait, I'm not sure actually. Maybe this isn't synced properly. True, and with a bit of a boof, 259. Yeah, this is still very, very close between uh, both sets of racers. Some 192s, 191 for Cosmic, not bad. Luke gets the 192 safe strat. Silver first to the key. German gets it, Cosmic gets it, right behind him. No, no, this is pretty close between these two going into the front door. Yeah, just watching here, this is, it, it's all going to come down to this. Um, I'm interested to know if they're keeping track of their opponents, but we'll see. German slightly faster out of two. Has a little trouble with door though. Oh, look at this sink. Wow. Wow, this is almost a kitchen sink right here. Truman going for the fly. I'm finding it hard to sync Moo Mooney and Silver Star. I can't actually tell. I think this is quite close between them. Yeah, but get ready for a possible retime. Yeah. Okay, so Silver Star got first hit on 914. Let's see about Moo Mooney. Look okay, away so for just a moment. Um, the Cosmic get a slow hit because suddenly it looks like Truman just got a little more ahead. Yeah, so at this point, Silver Silver Star with a pretty, pretty nice advantage. Uh, Me many struggling a bit. The is one. It's a pretty unfortunate time loss. It's going to be quite hard to come back from that if Silver Star doesn't make any mistakes. Oh, we got to watch Cosmic. That was close. He got it. Looked like Cosmic got a near or frame perfect ball skip. Do we know if Cosmic was using SRL timing on his timer? I sort of feel like he might have lost time. I'm not sure. Yeah, he had one slow hit there at the end of the second phase. Every time you do that, that's what, about a half a second lost. Big congrats to Silver Star in the 1044. That's a really nice run. That's a heck of a time. Meanwhile, Truman with a 10.53 on his timer. I don't have SRL up. 
and a 1055 for Cosmic. Um, oh, that's really impressive. GG's. So I'm not sure if we're quite in retime territory. Um, if Cosmic feels happy enough with that, then we'll be continuing on to race two. But wow, that was that was so close. Looked like slow hits was the difference in the end. So I believe in Cosmic's first race, uh, well, first two or three races, uh, his times were like mid-12, pretty much was a casual run both times. But from what we've seen there, it's uh, far from casual. Very, very impressive stuff. Um, but solid run from Truman as well. So, GG. Move finishes with about an 11.20. And that's going to do it for the first set of races. Yeah, Moo Mooney got really, really close. Uh, within two seconds of Silver Star going into Bowser. But um, made a couple of mistakes. And then lost away 40 seconds. Sorry, I do, I do apologize about the smoke alarm. It's really unfortunate. But it beeps. Wow, yeah. no claps. DQ, Silver Star. <laughs> okay, so we're going to quickly set up to get the second set of races underway. Truman and I, are up 1-0. I reckon in Cosmic and Truman, we're very likely to see this go 1-H. I think that's possibly going to happen. Uh, Cosmic's been playing really well, but... I mean, obviously, if Truman just does that again, uh, he probably will take it down. But I expect both of these matches could quite easily go one each. Um, we've been seeing a lot of these better runners uh, have that happen. So Bob, when's your match? I noticed, um, I think you have scheduled, don't you? I am, um, my match with Umar is tomorrow night at seven o'clock Eastern. Oh, that's gonna be a good one. Okay, um, I'll take note of that. Yeah, I, like I say, I'm sweating now just a little bit because Umar, he's, he's a consistent player. There are a lot of consistent players left. Yeah, I think Umar has done really well. I would be uh, nervous going up against him. Also, it's going to be hard because, you know, he's a part of my Green Dog army. like second room is up so I reckon I'm probably gonna ask Louie if he wants to go tomorrow but if that's too short notice for him then I'm, I'm feeling Saturday. I think Sunday is the worst day for me. Um, I'm going to be partying on Saturday evening for my birthday. Well, but, let's see. Can we get a live booking? <laughs> uh, if he's in chat, then who knows? We can, we can discuss it if he, if he wants. That's fine. He's asking I'm for a four-way. Oh, Louis, you are there. I'm still blind. Hello. Yuli, do you want to go tomorrow or Saturday? Would either of those days suit you? It's really nice because you're in Italy and that's only one hour away. What a luxury. Party hard. I will, especially if I beat the Italian Stallion, also known as Louis. Tomorrow is better. Okay, it's a date. I'll see you there. What Two out of seven people say I'm going to win. 
and one of those people is me. So, yeah. This is now great. We're going to have the one and the two on the same day. As far as seeds go. Mm Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. Big congrats again to Seathorn on uh, his victory against Volpe. I thought Volpe maybe had the slight edge. One in so three. Much experience. There's, but. I gotta correct myself, one in three. Sorry, Silver Star. You okay, it looks like, oh. my bad, but it looks like we're getting started. Yeah, looks like we're very, very close here. Yeah, Kat, I'm looking forward to your match with Iron. I think that's going to be crazy. Should we just get a one through five? Hmm. Okay, folks, welcome back to this double header. As always, it's a best of three. Uh, Truman took down the first one, and Silver Star took down the other one. The best of luck to all four runners. We saw all of them so close going into Bowser. Um, good first races. I'm predicting three retimes for Kat and Aaron. Could very well be possible. I mean, Dramscat has been playing extremely well, and of course, Aaron, a top level player. I don't know, want to sign that I'm trivializing this, but. Hopefully no issues from Y3. I think all four of these guys will be pretty comfortable. Uh, pretty comfortable. Prayer <laughs> emoji. <laughs> yeah, looks like our prayers are answered. Everyone got 259. Easy every time. Except whenever it's not, you know. And this time for me, Moo Mooney and uh, Silver Star are a lot more synced up on the streams. That's good. Looks like Cosmic had a minor issue, 275 at the pipe. Yeah, so Truman with his very early minor advantage. But a second's quite nice, you know, three second and more long over your opponent. Also, uh, Cosmic, the only one playing on the North American version, so gonna lose half a second over Truman. And that advantage also gives you a bit of a buffer for Donut Plains 1 because Indeed. of variable flight speed. Uh, Donut Plains 1. We've seen flight speed uh, decide a couple of matches, or at least, you know, have been enough to have helped decide a match. That's to be expected in uh, these very, very short runs. Nice slide kill by Kozovic. I'm proud of him for doing that strat. And uh, Silver Star as well with a very nice line strat. Yes, it has is the best strat. I love it so much. Absolutely. That's yeah, it is really nice looking. And it's fastest.
And if you paid attention there, you saw the difference between the two versions. Everyone has their capes and we're flying. Oh, Cosmic here. Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. Able to get the feather from the last guy. But this is going to be a little tricky. Yeah, that was that was hard to see. Silverstar having to get the blue block here. 247. Looks like Truman had a 56. Moo with a 250. Yeah, ended up having to take the P-switch with him. Uh, nice backup hit, but ended up being quite slow overall. So, Silver Star with a nice lead. Uh, Cosmic very much needing Truman to make a mistake in order to pull this back, but we've definitely seen it happen. Not too far apart between Silver Star and Moo Moo. Uh, Moo happened to get a bit. Uh, a bit careful with those booze. So Silver Star finished 602 on the clock and Moo is at 610, so about eight seconds. If the timers are right. Looks like uh, Truman and Cosmic are about 15 seconds apart. Couldn't quite get the Smash Sola the second go. Silver Star. Uh, Truman overall with decent zips going to at 9. Nice recovery on missing the second Smash Ola. Getting it uh, quite quickly after missing it, which is quite nice. Moo also got a 286, so they're even from that stage. Yeah, with Moo being behind, pretty much needing uh, Star World 1 to go at least slightly better than uh, Silver, but not quite making it. Truman had Blue Yoshi separation problems there. Mm -hmm. Now, if these mistakes pile up some, Cosmic can possibly get back. Oh, but he had an interesting moment right there. Looked like he hit the button and flew completely over the key to the right. That was weird. Truman, I don't Star World 4 in one piece. That's good. Truman out, Silver Star into front door. front door so oh was oh he missed the slide into door two German getting final boss but he makes it through into dark room
and Silver Star's in. And Cosmic right here. Oh, he runs right into the little Bowser guy there. Uh, oh, no. That's... Yeah, that's, that's possibly sealed the deal for Cosmic. Doing the Last time thing. Silver Star. Go ahead. I was just mentioning Cosmic going in and getting the feather from three. Yeah, good decision. If you're getting Cape Kill, um, then it makes sense to do that. But um, yeah, so earlier I was going to say Silver Star was looking very comfortable last time on Bowser, but I ended up making a mistake. But oh, cosmic! Uh, well, thankfully for Silver Star, still in very good shape here. Uh, it's not the worst mistake to make. Meanwhile, Silver Star here finishes phase two, but does not have the key. I'm not sure the difference will be enough, though. The only difference being, unless something happens on through six, the Silver Star, a very, very strong new cap runner, so I'm expecting a pretty good. Yeah, as you say, that Silver Star gets the optimal final kill. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm not surprised. Uh, I pretty much expected uh, that exact hit, but that was a very, very nice run from both Silver Star and Truman, securing 2-0 victories, both of them. Yeah, it might have been a great time if it was those two, but they are the winners. Indeed. I think this is the best. I think this is the best I've seen Truman do uh, in this tournament. I think that was very comfortable looking. Especially with him being so busy with other stuff recently. I think that was very, very good. Honestly, I think it was that 2 a.m. 96 exit run he did last night. Oh, I missed out on that. No, that's good to hear. I believe that's coming. Yes, GG, everybody. Um... We maybe got close both times, um, but yeah, Silver Star did whatever. And whenever, whenever someone like Silver Star isn't creating any opportunities, it's it's just not going to happen, unfortunately. Um, what's the seed of Silver Star? Two. Two. Oh, okay. And so with that, point exactly, I guess. Silver Star will go into the winners top eight. Yo, Silver, Silver Star. Star, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hello. Congrats. Thanks. <laughs> I was just saying that was a pretty convincing victory, even though Moo Mini uh, kept it close throughout. Uh, it just it sort of got a bit apart at the end. Um, but, yeah, I thought you and me when he played really well, but, yeah, very well done. Yeah, I heard from him that he almost had a PB on the first run as well. Yeah, things happened, I think, in phase one, but it was really close, uh, considering, you know, just how good your run was as well. You got a 10.45 <laughs> or 10.46. Or yeah. four, even on the his timer. Yeah, yeah. it was just sitting there. It was really close. It was either ten forty four or ten forty five flat. Um, really good stuff though. So yeah, definitely looking in good shape for your yeah. next round. Um, who's your next round? I'm trying to think. Let me get the. It's TNT or Chev. Yeah. Um. 
Well, both of them are really good. Um, I'm yeah. not sure what they're going to be pulling out, but I, I think you're looking good in that one. But we'll I was see. going to say, if I play as well as I did today, I can't complain about how my next race would go. Oh yeah, if you're if you're doing that again, I think you are a very solid favorite. Uh, certainly. But um, yeah, congrats, Truman. Thanks. Also, hello, Cosmic. That's fun. Hi, Cosmic. Nice runs. Same to you. That first race was too close. <laughs> Just trying uh, to scare you. Some really good stuff. I'm, I'm glad that you got a, another good run on the second one. If you got like a 11 flat or something that I could have beaten, I would have been really mad at myself for being terrible, but oh well. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, not run. understandable. I feel uh, pretty much the same way. If there was an opportunity to get over the line, it's a lot more frustrating. But whenever your opponent gets times like that, it, you know, it's easier to take, for sure. But I, I think he played really well in the first race. Yeah. Once I make, like, one mistake in a run, it kind of goes downhill. That's how the second one went. <laughs> but I'm, I'm happy with the first one. Yeah, lap and exit tends to snowball quite quickly. It's quite hard to make a recovery from as well. Unless you've got some pretty good new cave backups. But yeah, I think Truman played really well in both those runs. Yeah, um, definitely his bad side of races in this tournament so far. Oh, also we've got Moon Mooning. Got a full house. Go Moon Mooning. So. Hello. 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 Well, congrats anyway, uh, Moo, on those two runs. Getting pretty close. And that first run was a uh, pretty good pace as well. Thanks, it was a nice price, yeah. All right, I'm just checking the calendar for what's coming up. Um, yeah, you guys can talk amongst yourself if you want. Oh, uh, sorry, I think I missed uh, some word you said. I just said grats on the race, Moo Mooney. You played really well. Yeah, <laughs> if I uh, didn't uh, scrub uh, the early start of the first run, <laughs> I wasn't ready at all. <laughs> but it was funny. It's good, yeah, it was though. a lot of fun. But uh, yeah, Silver Star, let's uh, race again sometime. Yeah, that sounds good. Yes. Maybe I will be able to beat uh, my PB on race. Um, I got a I question. Hope you do. Um, I wanted to ask Cosby, um, what does this do for like, your confidence level knowing in that first race you kept up with Truman? <laughs> yeah. um, like, as far I as know. I'm not going to play Mario World more if that's what you're getting at. <laughs> <laughs> Darn. I, I don't know, dude. Um, it's kind of a short, optimized category. I have some experience in those, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> so in the second chance bracket, too many will be facing either Thunder Mustache, Rupert 83, Eric Maddox, or Monochrome. Um... Yeah, Rupert's Rippers a really, really good racer. Eric Maddox, uh, very good at SMW, and Thunder Mustache and Monochrome have both been doing very well in their races. So that'll be one to, to look out for, but I think Moo Mini is a decent favorite, uh, potentially. So good luck. I think you could do very well. Okay, so we have a race in 10 minutes. That race is between, let's see, uh, B squared and Carrick. Okay, so I'm, I think we're probably going to go offline and then come back online. I'm not sure. It's up to Matthew. But yeah, thanks all for the race. Yeah. It was yep. really good. Yeah, thanks for the race. Yeah, yeah that was yeah. my last round. Thanks, everyone, for putting the tournament on. 
yeah, it's been a blast. Thank a you for your participation. Indeed. That's the most important thing. And uh next time I'll drastically I'll, improve my PB before seating happens instead of Cosmic, after. I've been very impressed uh by how well you've done. Like your first your first race is compared to what we've seen tonight and then in your last race. Such a stark comparison, so although I can't be all that surprised from what you do to other Mario games, though. Keep it up. <laughs> Hopefully we'll see you more. And yeah. But thanks. Alright. All right. See you later, guys. Have yep. a good one.